Oh, great saves. Oh my god, what is going on? All right, all out attack. Something's got to give. Do we keep momentum? Hello and welcome to our Unknown to Icon series. I am Duper Daddy. In today's episode, we will be tweaking our tactics to try and find that winning formula. Because at the moment, we're going through a little bit of a bad run of form. Can we find a win and start moving up that table? Let's go find out. As you can see behind me, we're 16th in the table and we're playing at home to Chester. So if we go over to our tactics, what have I changed? Well, I've actually imported over our version two of our caution that I've created in our Tottenham save and then in our starting tactic I've changed our mentality from positive to balanced and then in possession when I loaded up this we had dribbling run out defense so I've removed that I don't know why we had that probably again if I watch back on videos it might explain why but while I'm trying to think logically of how I want my team to play and how I'm thinking about for FM23 match engine because you don't think about real life football you think about how the game and how the AI is thinking and is coded. In transition, we've kept the same, and out of possession, we've kept the same, but I want to carry on being high press. That involves a high line. I might take off step up more and put trigger press much more often just to keep a bit of shape. And that's what I'm going to be looking out for in this game. So, with that, let me choose my team. Just going to look at form. Maybe we'll make, see if we can make a couple of changes here. Glenn Walk is not playing well. Let's bring in Cardo Calder and who else can we replace? Maram Betsy. We can do when M Woods come back and nothing really there. Jay Richards is playing well. Uh, no, so we're waiting for M Woods to come back. I now mean, I could move Jay Richards into that position and play K Gonzalez. What for 0.02 of a better form? Overall, though, he's played better. 6.83. Actually, he's a free star player in there as well. Let's try him there. There's a box of box and move Jordan Rich as a defensive midfielder. Tackling wise, 10. Okay, let's just try it. You just never know. And then I'm going to keep rest of my team for now. And we are just going to pick subs like that. Uh, let's bring on puts. Should have just selected it myself, if I'm honest. Woods is coming back. So let's bring on Woods for Gonzalez. And Adam Rooney is going to come back as well. But puts him seems okay on form and let's get into it to do the right team talk team talk so da, 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 just our third and form table well we're 13th we need to step things up our home form is important to us so let's go out and make the advantage count yes we need to get better at home look at that lost drawn lost drawn lost it's gonna be a long season guys it's gonna be a long season i right, skip all this let's see how we play it's picked up injury already. Ah, uh, Jordan Richards. That means Merum Betsy needs to play there. Oh, actually, Richard, oh, is that too soon? We've got no choice. He needs to work on his match fitness and he's going to get pretty much 90 minutes. Uh, oh, yeah, we are at home. And some strange reason, we have to zoom out. Two for heavens. Oh, great saves. Oh, my God, what is going on? Did they just hit for post twice? All right, Calder. Can he get for crossing? What's he doing? Tamara and Betty. Woods. Let's go to a cracker. Oh, save crossbar. Armson Woods. Oh, if Armson scores today, he will be Brackley Town's top goal scorer ever. Right, we've had five shots on target one. They've had seven on target three. They're third in form table. And they're, 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 they're seventh in table, something like that as well. Come on. We're at home. And Armson, oh, beautiful ball to Stead, and that was an awful finish. Now, I wonder why we've only had one shot on target. Finishing is awful. Put ball into a box. I keep on saying it, and I don't put it on. Stead, can he take on the fence? He has got one in there. Asante's waiting, but it's just Asante's not interested. He was great first couple of games, and he's just gone quiet. And that's when we was banging him for goals. Right, one tweak, and that is... Work ball into box. How's our passing been? We haven't really been having possessions, so and it's raining as well. Pitch condition is going to be rubbish. So let's get passing more directly. Uh, our shooting has not been good enough so far. That really needs to improve. Yeah, no shit. Right, more direct passing, passing into space, and working the ball into box. It's 
It's very rare that I can see it on corners. I think I said this before, but I never scored corners. I think I've scored one in whole of Football Manager 23. Ooh, unlucky as Sante. What was that? We went all over the place. Knuckleball, they've had 10 shots. They've had a bit more possession, a bit more shots on target. Time for change. Sixth, fifth minute, we're losing. Third personnel change first. Asante's dropped now. York's dropped. Something's got to give. Come on, can we get something from this game? We played bad. We've got no choice. All right, all out attack. Last 15 minutes. Got to be careful that they don't break us. But if they get one, it's all over. If we bring one back, I mean, do we keep momentum? A camera. One or do we keep this momentum? Or do I change it? Is it all over or is there still going to be one more chance? Just never know. Oh, well, it be's through. And he, now he passes it across. Oh, it was offside. Happy with that. Uh, as I said, they're doing really well in the league. Third in for form table. I will take that. 17 shots still. Still creating 17 shots. Five on target. It's disappointing to their 16 and eight on target. We didn't play as well as we can, but I'm happy with the result. Yeah. That. Uh, we've got Jordan Richards out injured for five to six weeks. That's not good. He's quite a good little player. We are on the search for a win. We have not won for six games. So we drew, lost, drew, lost, drew, lost. Obviously one team battered us. We played our B team because that was the FA Trophy third round replay. Can we find it in our next game? We're playing Spennymore at home, who are ninth in the league. We are currently 16th. Tactics, work, ball into ball. I think I'm going to get rid of passing space for this team. Works really well with Premiership teams who's got really good passing abilities in their midfield. We don't have that. Attacking whip standard, higher tempo, balance, work it, ball into box. I'm going to take off, step up more and see what that does as well. See if that helps our defence, because obviously we're just giving away too many chances. Want to be a bit more compact. Jordan Richards got injured last game, so let's remove him for the result. Woods and probably put Mara and Budsy back there. What I'm going to do is I'm going to drop Asante and actually he's playing so bad. He's actually not going to be on my bench and we're going to bring Rooney on to a bench. Let's go. Our home form is important to us. I said that last time it didn't really work. Spending more. Yes, we need to step things up and I've got no reaction. Sometimes that's a good thing. So if you get a bad reaction, it's not a good way to start your game. Let's do this. All right, two games in this video. Back to back games. But I'm just so determined to get this win. Six games without a win. Some jobs work out, some jobs don't. Is this going to be one that doesn't work out for us? All into puts. No, I think. And now they've gone long and they will find it and they will score. No, good save it. Lewis. Lewis last game did really well. So glad that he's back in my team. I mean, he did get dropped for a bit. So ninth minute, we had one shot, one on target, and they've had three shots. Just had a free kick. Lewis saves. I'm certain. Stead. To Marin Betsy. Marin Betsy runs forwards. Oh, he has a crack. Saved. Was that a crossbar save? I can't see it. Can we make the ball orange? I probably still won't see it. <laughs> I think we are, at the moment, for players I've got and how it's set up, we are a mid-table team. I can't wait for the summer, just like I did with St Albans, and I said this before, I think we need to clear out. We've got a lot of expensive players here who are just waste of space. Ah, and we've got another injury. That defence midfield position is just injuring all my bloody players. All right, Woods needs to drop there. Gonzalez can go there. Can Armson drop back? Armson can drop back. Okay, that's fine. Aaron Betsy was having a good game. Worth noting. It's a shame, because his form was rubbish. And puts his out injured. I so that he had a knot, really. Probably longer than I wanted to play him. Is he the man that we've been missing from our team? Adam Rooney. Yeah, very even game. They're mid-table. They're seventh in the form table. And so we're competing. We are competing. Are we just unlucky? I don't know. Something's missing. It's time for everyone to dig in and give everything you've got left tonight. We deserve to win this match, so let's go and do it. Let's give them a bit of encouragement, shall we? All right, 60th minute. <sighs> what to do? So, right, we've been forced into two changes. Cowder's playing rubbish. But I've got another one to take him off. I've got my camera, so I could take York off and bring my cam on, but not yet. Do we need to do anything? And we haven't conceded. Maybe better as a DLF attack. And I'm actually going to make him as a Mazella attack. Used to have that. I don't know why I changed that. I mean, attacking wise. 
And we're going to push through the middle and again go direct. Floaty crosses, try things out. Let's see what happens. Spenny more have the ball. Trying to press it. Is that press just not good enough? It's pressing not good for lower leagues. I will go full out change and go really back to basics. Might even go to like 4-4-2. Four, four, think on balance and just watch for games. Might have to watch a 90 minute game. Just learn of what my players are doing, what four positions are doing down in this league. Go on, Stead. Go on, get the ball in. Yolk. Ooh, unlucky. Another little thing I want to try is let's um, trap them outside. We don't want them playing through the gap. So by trapping them outside, that means that we'd be more tight, I guess. All 74th minute. Okay, my camera can come on now for York and change him over for Stead. Right, nine minutes to go. Can we get a goal or is this going to be another draw? Is this going to be another game where we don't get a win? Our seventh game in a row that we don't get a win. Eight fourth minute and he had three shots on target. So has worked ball into a box really helped us and nothing. Two minutes extra time. So we got less than a minute, minute left to go. Have I got him, Nicky, last minute winner? I hate this. Uh, we've cleared it up to Rooney. We've got it, Gonzalez gone. What's he doing? 20 seconds on clock to Rooney and no. Nope. Five seconds left. Clear our lines. Nope, it's dropped down to them. Blow for a whistle. And he has. All right, another draw. Two really tight games. The second game was really tight. And obviously in the first game, we did our all attack tactic. And we got that goal to get us a draw. But two draws. So one all and nil nil. Definitely second game we played a bit better. But work ball into their box. Is that really paying off? Don't think so. We will continue, probably in the background, try out this tactic. We won't make any tweaks yet. I'm going to give it two, three more games, see if we get that win, if it's losses and draws, and then we need to just go back to the scrapbook and create something new. If you want to see a tactic that actually is working at the moment in our second season on our Tottenham save, go check out this playlist.